Hello and welcome to our Indiegogo page. My name is Nick Tady, I'm the director and I also play the role of Vinny. My name is Mark Lombardo, I'm the writer of On the Ropes and I also play the role of Joey. Um, I started writing this story back in November with my good friend Ryan Burke who's also going to be the cinematographer and um, it started as a 10 minute short, uh, then it was 25 minutes, then it was 40 minutes and then I brought it to Mark and he said listen this is a, this is a very character driven piece that I think needs to be told um, in a longer form. He said let, let, let's make a feature film with this thing and um, I agreed and then we started working together on the script. <laughs> So I'm going to start by telling you a little bit about the characters. The story revolves around Joey, who is a down-to-earth boxer with a heart of gold. This is a guy who loves his family and his community. Joey's having a hard time breaking into the professional boxing realm. And he's also having money trouble, so he has to sacrifice what he cares about most to help support his family. Fucking beautiful. So she I is. I agree, <laughs> but baby, I I don't act the way he does. So why are you? Scared. Yeah, but why are you blaming him? Why are you blaming me for his because actions? Because I'm scared. Okay. Well, why are you scared? Because you I just I don't know. It makes me. You feel know bad. what? I said, tell me if I'm lying. Baby. Julie is Joey's girlfriend. Baby. This is a strong baby. woman who's loving and tenacious, baby. working two jobs, oh. and is in business school. This is a woman who will get anything she has to done to support her family. Everything that I do, everything. Okay. Julie became unexpectedly pregnant when she was in college. She had to give up her dream of writing. Chad is Gianna's biological father. This is a guy who works on Wall Street, and his priority was always money. He met Julie in a bar one night, and they had a brief romance that led to a pregnancy. Chad had to come into maturity and realizes years after that he wants his family back. Vinny is Joey's best friend. He's another down-to-earth guy that Joey has known since childhood. Everybody immediately falls in love with Vinny because of his charisma. And Vinny is easily Joey's biggest supporter. Bobby is Vinny's older brother and Joey's manager. Bobby always longed for his brother's charisma and respect, but he could never get it. He's always coming up with hair-brained schemes that blow up in his face. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna fu I'm gonna fucking kill this dude one day. I swear to God. I swear to fucking God. No. He's my brother. I'm gonna fucking kill him. No, you don't go around these. I'll fucking kill him first. Maria is Vinny's wife and Julie's best friend. She acts as a mother hen to the group who helps, with Vinny, corral everyone into a community. <laughs> so now we have no money to pay for the baby. That sucks. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We always fucking figure mm. out it. We good. Father Tom O'Malley is originally part of the group. He made some difficult decisions and had some legal struggles. He disappeared. When he came back to the community, he was a priest, and he wanted to bring his gifts to the community. After finding God, he had his own message to spread. And what better place than to do it than in the belly of the beast? Jerome is Joey's mentor and childhood hero. This is the man who trains Joey as a boxer. In his own day, he was a celebrity but that day is long gone. He's now struggling to keep his gym afloat and he's turned to desperate measures to make money. That's my favorite thing about the script is, is the characters. Um, you know, we're, we're dealing with real people, real issues, and I think everyone out there will be able to relate to, to a character in the story one way or another. I think primarily our goal has been truth. And uh, a lot of people that we're pulling from Playhouse West, Brooklyn Lab, primarily, that's our goal within our line of work. These are all people who want to get to the core of the human condition. And these are people who are working for nothing to get at it. You know, we, we're just a bunch of people, artists, who want to come together and really make something special. Um, and in order to realize that, this thing that started off at 10 minutes is now over an hour and a half long. We're going to need your resources and we're going to need your help. Yeah. So that's why we're coming to you um, to help us realize this dream. Yeah. Whatever you can contribute to help make this dream a reality for us, you know, whether it be one dollar or a thousand dollars. Yeah, it will make a tremendous difference. Yeah. So I want to say thank you on behalf of Brooklyn Playhouse West. I'm Mark Lombardo. I'm Nick Tady. Thank you so much. You give that up? <laughs> <laughs> that was great. <laughs>